fans ringside. And look at look at this ovation for Bobby Orlando. I think these fans really connected to him when he threw that chain down, honestly. I think that really showed a different side of Bobby Orlando because usually he gets a little crazy, as you know, but he had that moment of clarity, and I think people respect him for that. Well, we'll be uh, interested to see if maybe we could see more of those moments of clarity or if Arjun Singh is going to strike quick. And that's what the Cobra is known to do. That is why he has been dubbed the Cobra. Those strikes come fast and quick, and they are deadly, so we will see if he is able to connect on those strikes. But I think these people also rallied behind Bobby Orlando after what Mortar did to Bobby Jr. Jr. because they have really taken to uh, Bobby Jr. But Bobby Orlando showing respect there to Arjun Singh. Uh, well, that's part of the madness of getting in the ring with Bobby Orlando. You never know what this guy is going to throw at you because he doesn't know what he's going to throw at you himself. There is a sick trick by Bobby Orlando temporarily distracting Arjun Singh. Uh, Bobby Orlando reminds me of like a Tasmanian devil or something. He is just... He's a lunatic. But it, it's a different kind of lunacy. No, Arjun Singh not falling for it this time. And instead another sick trick. This time a stomp to the foot. Shoulder block by Orlando. And he is on a roll here against Singh. As he is able to outsmart the Cobra. Singh in the corner. Dedicating that chop to Bobby Jr. And of course, Bryce Donovan, we wish him the best in his recovery process. I know he's watching at home tonight, but Arjun Singh looking to stop Bobby Orlando in his tracks before he could get moving. Yeah. Bryce Donovan, a collapsed lung, needed surgery. No timetable on his return to professional wrestling or wrestling open. That time, Arjun Singh thought that he had the chop scouted. Instead, got two to the back, one to the chest, and he finds himself in a precarious position. There is a count of two. And this crowd, it, it, it really tells a lot that they are getting behind Bobby Orlando after all of his antics during the first handful of weeks here at Wrestling Open. Did he grab his hair? He definitely went to a vulnerable part on the anatomy, but it doesn't look like he was able to do too much for oh. that. As he took Bobby Orlando out of midair, did Arjun Singh with that European uppercut. And Bobby Orlando is in a bad way. Oof. A stop to the midsection from Arjun Singh. Of course, training under the tutelage of Harley Race and the Dudleys, you are going to learn a lot of tricks to have up your sleeve. So, Some if, sick tricks? Uh, not exactly sick tricks, but tricks nonetheless, as now here are those strikes that the Cobra likes to lay in. Well, Bobby Orlando trying to get himself off the ropes, instead walking even into more of those kicks. So Bobby Orlando collapsed under the mat, and this could be enough to put him away. Only a one count. Only a count of one as Arjun Singh. Arjun Singh's arguing that it's a three. Not even anywhere close. Bobby Orlando still showing signs of life as he's trying to fight back right now. And he's got Singh stumbled. The big open strike. But ran right into the waiting arms of his opponent. Singh's got Orlando up on the shoulders. And a running power slam. It's the power slam. Hooks the leg. And a kick out by Bobby Orlando. And for Arjun Singh... I really think the madness of Bobby Orlando got to him that he's so frustrated he was arguing a one count as a three earlier on. Yeah, he's definitely frazzled. That one was closer to three. I could understand him at least questioning the official on that one. I don't know that I've ever seen an official uh, change his answer in any match when a competitor gets in the official's face, but Bobby Orlando still trying to create some distance, and that time the Cobra striked but missed. His knee goes across that top rope. Bobby Orlando, flapjack down to the mat. Trying to go for that cover. No, brings Singh back to his feet and sends him crashing down with a back suplex. Yeah, but Bobby Orlando needed to use that top rope to pull himself back up to his feet. I think that Singh's done a lot of damage with his strikes thus far in the match. And now some more sick tricks here from Orlando as Singh going back and forth on those top turnbuckles. He's reeling. I don't think Singh knows where he is right now. Missing with that strike and collapsing to the canvas. Bobby Orlando, instead of going for the pin, up to the top rope. Great athleticism and agility shown by Orlando as he goes up top. Can he get his balance, Paul? Going for the dab elbow. Ridiculous. He... No, Singh out at two. He got some really impressive air there. Usually we're not used to seeing that athleticism come out. 
but that is why Bobby Orlando is such a dangerous competitor. Well, it's almost like without Bryce Donovan in his ear, now instead he can really hear what the fans here in Worcester, Massachusetts, <coughs> excuse me, think of him, and uh, I think that it's having an influence on the proceedings. But how about that knee strike from the Cobra? Boot up from Orlando. Hits oh. the cutter from the second rope. Excuse Could me. that be all? Hook of the leg. Bobby Orlando picks up the victory at Wrestling Open.